Just over 48 hours until FIU kicks off their first game of the season against UCF. And joined by Butch Davis. Coach, last time we chatted was after the final scrimmage of training camp. Now, just two days out until the season opener. And I'll, for you, personally, a game week once again, how, how good does it feel? It's very good. I mean, obviously, I'm excited, but my excitement obviously comes a little bit from the kids. I mean, just watching the way that they practiced in the last 10 days. Once we turned our attention to the opponent, we really started to focus in on, on Central Florida and their offense, defense, special teams, the kids, the amount of film that they've watched, the intensity in practice, how they're paying attention to the coaching points and those kinds of things has been very encouraging. I think our leaders and the seniors of this football team have done a great job of taking the young kids. In the springtime, it was the redshirt freshmen and the sophomores, kind of talking to those guys, helping them understand how important it is to get prepared to study film, to know your assignments. And then when the true freshmen came over the summertime, they've done a good job of taking them in meetings and talking to them during the course of practice. And, and we will. I mean, I, you know, on both sides of the ball and on special teams, conceivably as many is 8 to 12 of our true freshmen are going to have to play a role. It may be a backup. It could be as a starter in, in some of those situations, but we're going to have to count on them to provide some of the depth. Confidence on the team has just skyrocketed, man. Uh, we're just going out there knowing that we can go out there and everybody do our job. We'll go out there and get the W. Uh, yeah, I do think about last year's game because for me, that's it's more so of a redemption game for me because I had a horrible game that game. But, um, man, I want to go out there and help this team get this W. And uh, we're definitely focused this year, going out there full throttle, locked in, laser focused, so we can get go out there and get that W. As a player, I don't care how much, how long you've been playing. You always get butterflies when you like when you're going into your first game. So you know, it's a little bit of butterflies, but it's mostly confidence, knowing that I know what to do when I get out there, and the rest of the team does too. For the most part, as a group, we take a lot of pride in um, trying to be the best group on the field at all times, running to the ball, communicating effectively. So as a group, yeah, I feel like um, we did a good job getting everybody ready. Uh, their defense last year, you know, was very productive defensively. They're big and strong at the point of attack. Probably uh, just reading all the clippings and looking at the film from last year and things, you know, the marquee players of their team are their defensive linemen. They're big, they're physical. Uh, they've got some new guys in the secondary, very similar to us. And so, you know, game number one, obviously, you need to find out, you know, how talented are they, how well can they run, and, and those kinds of things. And, uh, you know, but it'll be, uh, I think our kids are prepared to, to play this first game. I was just going out there and doing our job, focusing on. On, on what we have to do, uh, focus on the little things uh, like pass protection, uh, doing our read steps and all that stuff. We go out there and do what we're supposed to do, and we have a great chance of winning the game. Honestly, um, everybody doing their one eleven, so everybody doing their individual job, and the players are just come. It's just the overall atmosphere and just the way we coach to the way we're motivated and the way that um, they tell us to go after things like that is just really motivating and it's gotten us better. Well, there's two aspects of it. One, obviously, is trying to teach our players this is the routine that we're going to be in. We will never deviate from the things that we try to do in game week, whether it starts on Sunday and the players' day off on Monday and Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursdays. Uh, today, was uh, even though it wasn't a Thursday on the calendar, it's Thursday as far as game preparation. So, uh, you know, we spend a lot of time on what we call special category type of things, things that uniquely come up during the course of the game. And they may only happen maybe four or five times in a game, but we want to make sure that you're emphasized a lot of the different third down situations uh, situations short yardage goal line all those different things that come up during the course of the game kind of the finishing touches to those and making sure that our guys are all on the same page that they can execute anything that we would call excited man can't wait to get out on that field man uh, and show what we all about this year man it's very exciting for us <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.